All right, I had to pretty much wait for my really hot room to cool down a bit. But hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only, and welcome back to some more Dragon Blaze. Uh, first things first, our little flaming turtle here. We're going to do that in a second. But I have been farming a lot lately. I'm going to throw these in here. I have nearly 200 essence. Yeah, 200 trans essence, nearly. And as you guys can see, I'm really low on gold right now. I keep forgetting to put in my adventure rings. I don't know how I keep forgetting it, but yeah, I just go straight into farming and just never realize it. But that's pretty much it. Um, I do have a lot of runes that I could actually put in, but the thing is, I don't want to use any of my rubies right now, just because I'm trying to save them all for each daily dungeon every day and once I get to a good point where I can actually start using rubies again for like uh, go to stuff like that or just earn it naturally through dungeons and everything uh, yeah it's gonna be a while before that happens though so yeah all I know is as soon as I do it I'm gonna run out of rubies to be able to do daily dungeons and I don't want that to happen <laughs> so I'm trying to keep it off as much as I can ah <sighs> the struggle so this one this team is kind of different from um, last week if well pretty much the same team but different formation the last formation was fire support this one is right here Incredible concentration. So I wanted to see how that did compare to fire support. I don't know how good it's gonna be. I'm really hoping it makes a difference. But it doesn't seem like it's going to pass, but then again, we should survive ten minutes again. Like we did last week. At least I hope so. Oh, never mind. The damage is jumping up quite nicely. So sooner or later we'll make it. If it keeps up like this. All I've been doing lately is trying to regain some sleep. Because I've been really lacking on it. Especially when it comes to like editing or streaming or... Well, in case you guys don't know, normally when I record videos it only takes like probably an hour or two depending on what I'm recording. If it's the Prey series, I'll normally record for like at least two hours and try to get like four videos ahead. Or if I'm just recording the two videos for today, it'll probably just take like a whole hour. But the editing takes like, let's say another hour. Then rendering it takes like an hour or two just to get done but during those hours or two I try to sleep and to pass the time and you know trying to like rejuvenate myself so I can get ready to keep on going and it ends up being like I guess it ends up being a whole day I'm pretty much just working on videos let's just say that then I try to stream for at least at least four hours or more really depends all right seems like we're a little far back but no real changes in HP right now well except for Landy she's kind of lacking a little bit I, I kind of feel like Landy isn't all that useful for this anymore. Thank god I didn't get her to ultimate. Maybe she'll be useful for something else. Because when Lenny was first like released, she was increasing damage really good. But now it's just kinda like she fell off the face of the earth. Which really does suck, because she is an amazing healer, especially at ultimate. But can't really say that anymore. 
Like, the thing is, I'm catching up to it. So I'm just like several points off. That's the only issue here. But then again, it's starting to increase again. Let's see if it can stay like that. If that's really all I want, is it to uh, just pretty much just be like that the whole time, just increasing by like 20% in this. Well, 20. 20 bill? I had to do math in my head, it just took a while. <laughs> But it seems like we're getting somewhere, at least. Like, it's not a half bad team. But I think we just passed it. If it would increase again by how much it was increasing by. Kind of fell off there. And we made it. Okay, sweet. Now progress is kicking in. But it was just, like, way later. So we're getting that score back. Yeah, for now on, I should just pretty much play it fully through without quitting. Ah, uh, Landy's dead. Rip. Pretty sure our damage is going to fall off a little bit with Landy dead. Yeah, it's, it kind of fell off. Now it's just staying within like the million for like point gain which happens unfortunately uh, Falcon could be next the only reason Falcon and Landy die so early is just because they're still base <laughs> so I could have had like a higher score if they were still alive so we made some progress here it's just Kind of fell off as soon as Landy died. Oh, and the family's dead. That's another reason why. Okay, this time playing it through is not going to be worth it just because it's going to be taking up a lot of time. And plus, our score is not going to go anywhere. It's pretty much got to the point where it's just falling off too much. Unfortunately. But it seems like we did a lot better with Fire Sport on. Uh, wait, why did I come here? <laughs> oh yeah, Tag. That was the wrong place for Tag. Alright. Wait, hold up. What was recommended? We're still using Foxy in here. Okay. Only 14% is using Foxy. I won't lie, I might get Foxy to ultimate. As the next, well, one of my next characters to ultimate. Okay. Just because she is actually pretty strong. I'm trying to remember what what skill card do I have on her? Wow, it doesn't seem like the fox stays long on a uh, falcon. Oh, the controls doesn't either. Yeah, I kind of saw that one coming. How should be able to finish her off, and Till should be able to take this one out. Cause I just want to avoid as many insta kills that I that I can. Alright, so we're going to use Till to stall that off. As long as she can. As 
gonna be gone sooner or later. There we go. And boom. Kayla is out of there. Like, it looks actually pretty nice installing uh, Gala, but at the same time, it's that she has to be like really tanky for it. All right, none of my debuffs are gonna work on her. Because still has absolute immunity to pretty much every last debuff in the game. As you can see, it's saying that I'm hitting defense down on her, but I'm actually not. I think only one buff got through, and that was like the fire one, and that was it. Maybe I should just take her out. That'll probably be the better idea. Alright, we don't have to switch over. But he is going to stall with that. Um, hmm. Not really afraid of Gala and, unless she's max. Just because, like I've always said, she doesn't get her little fidget spinner into max. So she's not really all that powerful. Once you get her to max, then she starts to shine a little bit. But ultimate, the ultimate ones you guys have to watch out for. I still need to work on my Gala. Like, I got her, but I never worked on her. I think I only got her to like plus three, and that was it. Yeah, definitely should work on her sooner or later. Especially for tag. Like, she's really good in tag. That's why she has such a high recommended for a uh, tag team right now. Alright, game. I know that's not everybody. <laughs> about to say like I know you have more people in there all right so this is what team we're going up against all right there we go we thunder just uh kind of force out that I wanted to get her from being invisible, so I kind of forced it out. Alright, we're going to switch. I'm going to kill the Foxy, so she has to become my issue later. So. She can't do anything about canceling out her summons. So that's pretty much mine. Or not, if the game wants to screw me out of trying to take a summon. Excuse me? Alright, whatever. <laughs> I'm so confused about that, but alright. Alright, so here's what I'm going to do. We want to howl. Because howl is actually pretty good. I guess Margaret. Oh no, he wanted to change? Okay. We're gonna stun again. You got to switch out again. Yep, thought so. And there we go. We're gonna bring out Till. Install it off. Got Hall, so we can continue to stall it. And perfect. Let's say, well, hold up. What's going on here? She's not losing any HP. There's an issue here. <laughs> All right, there we go. Perfect. Hey, my strats are working out just a little bit. Just 
This is somewhat. Oh boy. Next. At least I actually got a person who actually changes out the characters in fight. Those are the real interesting battles. Oh, he has a Falcon with the whole invisibility thing on it. Okay. It's weird. I don't see that too often. Alright. Let's go ahead and stun that. So we can waste that invisibility. Never mind. Guess I don't know too much about Falcon. Yes, heal me, Landy. Heal me. Okay, hold up. Maybe this will work. But then again, it is Falcon after all. I don't think it is. Just a little bit of damage going in. I gotta remember life still does come into play, so I should be good. Let's do this. Let's see if he'll bring in Margaret later. I'm gonna give it a little bit of time so if I can refresh. Because I know Till can tank out a lot. out. Now we should be doing a lot of damage. There we go. Because Hal is pretty strong against uh, with the Elka and there's the bug again. <laughs> Let's go ahead and stun. To be honest, I think he should have put the invisibility on Kayla. He still would have had a chance, a better chance. I mean, pretty much every last person puts it on Gala. Just because she needs that time to actually, you know, kind of get that power building up. I still love that. Randomly just take over a unit and they just instantly come out of it. It's not even the takeovers that's actually her bread and butter. It's pretty much her damage you can ditch out. The thing I don't get is why the fox does not last long. Okay, my stuns did not work. Okay, I thought that was gonna go way different, but okay, game. Yeah. I don't know why I changed out against this. I guess since I saw it was Gala, I just like went with the same strategy I always go with. But I shouldn't be too afraid of her. I mean, she's doing decent damage. I'll give her that. But I just summoned the really heavy hitters here. Thank God she was able to kill him before the instant kill kicked in. I mean, Graysoul can bring back some pretty difficult games, I can say that. If I was to say Gala versus Graysoul, I would probably go with um, Hmm. 
I'd probably go with Grey Soul just because you have a better chance of making a combat instead of like charging up. But if you're in a fight against a character that can't take like, well, that can withstand like insta kills like Till, uh, then you're kind of in quite the predicament there. Just because Till is pretty much immune to all debuffs as soon as she starts. Uh, hold on, how much time do we have? Okay, we're gonna make this our last one. This should be a challenging one, too. I don't think we can win it, but at the same time, it should be interesting. There we go. Uh, excuse me? Oof. One HP wonder? I just saw you get back that huge chunk of HP. You're gonna have to calm down there. Have to calm down there. So it's on his great. So what? I guess he wanted to do Graysol versus Graysol. That's why he changed out. Yeah, both our Graysols are really tanky, bro. Uh, I don't know. I'm pretty sure yours should win since he is ultimate after all, but okay. Oh, alright. Okay. Uh, let's do another one. We're not going to go out like that. We're going to find someone who's willing to fight us to the end. <laughs> I don't know why you left, though. Gotta say, Mika is actually... Well, the way people build Mika actually surprises me. Oh, there's the instant kill. Let's avoid that. I got hit by Grey Soul's insta kill, so yeah, Foxy automatically died. Unfortunately. Now, like I said, I would still go with uh, Grey Soul, even if he can be countered by Till, which you barely ever see a Till inside of Tag. To be able to like, well, what I was gonna say is, barely ever see a till to decide to like tag from people just because they don't try encounter Graceo, or they don't really think about it. So my words got mixed up there. Uh, okay, yep, and that's another person. All right, let's go again. Come on, give me somebody really good. Yeah. A cookie jar. <laughs> yeah, we'll take this guy on. See how that goes. Okay. Okay, I was about to say, like, game? Hello? Wait, where'd she g I'm so confused what just happened there. But okay. I'm gonna wait a few because the game likes to be like oh hey wait a minute the worst part is that she summoned foxy out of everything and foxy's able to control things so his bell is gonna have some issues with that because she's about to take over summons as well if she lives into Bell. Alright, there's another one. Alright, so she ended up stunning uh, Storm. Alright, so she killed uh, Foxy. Good to know, but the thing is, I can still pretty much stall until my pup is ready again. That's the amazing part here, and... Oh. Jesus, Storm Bear. <laughs> Alright, do all the damage then. We'll just sit here and watch you. Alright, Storm Bear lost his, uh... takeover color. What? What even? 
That's the first time I've seen that. Let's say he's dead, Margaret. Uh, the unfortunate part is he still can't change out. Once he summons it, it's pretty much over. But then again, Trigger is immune to that, now that I think about it. Uh, when she's charging up her attack, she's immune to all attacks. So that's an interesting kind of little thing going on there. Come on, bro. You have your other abilities. I was about to say, like, come on, man. Alright, let's go ahead and kill her so she won't do anything. And now I shall bring out my Margaret. Alright, pretty decent enemy. Alright guys, I'm gonna end it here. We got eight victories. No losses today. A little bit better. A little bit better. You know, I still gotta pretty much ultimate the team in there, so yeah, that's kind of a chore. But hope you all enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next video, which will be Tuesday? Yeah, Dragon Blaze videos are on Tuesdays and Fridays. So then, peace out. Meanwhile, on the horror channel. Okay, am I stuck right here? I think I'm actually stuck. Are you kidding me?